Hi there, I'm Parveen and welcome back to Exploring Me where I explore different aspects of my professional and personal life. In today's video, I'm going to be talking about an aspect of the data analysis process, specifically data visualization. I'm going to be sharing my thoughts and opinions on two different platforms, Power BI and Tableau. You might be thinking, why are you making yet another video on this topic? Because if you go ahead and search those key terms on YouTube, you are going to see a ton of different videos comparing and contrasting of just these two platforms. And though these are the two front runners, ultimately they aren't, you know, the only drag and drop type tools that are available, but I do think that they are definitely the most common. The reason I wanted to share my two cents on Tableau and Power BI is that I found that a lot of the other videos tend to compare pros and cons in terms of their features so they'll list a bunch of those things out but they don't necessarily give you their own professional opinion on which one might ultimately be the best at least in the work that they do and that's what I wanted to bring to the table in the end of the day of course this is going to be just my opinion but a little bit of background I have used both of these platforms in a professional setting so in my previous role I was exclusively using Tableau and now in my current role we exclusively use Power BI so I definitely have experience on all of the features and know sort of the ins and outs of all of those. What I'm not going to be doing in this video is rattling off all of those different features of Power BI or all of the different data sources you can connect to in either platform. Those types of things, I think you can go ahead and look on their website and make the best decision for yourself. This is going to be my opinion on which tool you should go ahead and learn if you're looking to get into the field or if you're looking to bring in the platform to your business and add it to your data analysis arsenal, which platform do I think is ultimately best? And I should say, I'm only going to be comparing these two platforms in terms of my recommendation on their visualization capabilities. I think a lot of the time when folks go ahead and compare and contrast Tableau and Power BI, they get into a lot of different things like data transformation. So they'll share that Power BI can do X, Y, and Z and do really powerful joins or something like that. Or they'll say that Tableau can you know, handle a really large data set. While those things are really neat to have at your disposal and they do make some things easier. I don't think that they should be your ultimate, you know, end all be all decision maker because in the end of the day, if you're doing really heavy data transformation in either of these platforms, that's not what they're made to do. In the end of the day, they're data visualization tools and that's what they should be, you know, the best at. If you're doing really heavy data transformation, I think that you should be using a platform that is made for that. So whether that be whatever SQL platform or some cloud computing database platform, you should be using sort of the best tool for the job and combining their best features whenever possible. So purely in terms of visualization tool, without further ado, I'm just going to share off the bat that my preference is for Tableau. I think in the end of the day, it is the best data visualization platform. And when I say data visualization platform, I mean its innate ability to create different types of visualizations in the easiest way possible. So in the end of the day, there will always be ways that you can sort of hack together different visualizations. And I have found many ways to find workarounds in Power BI to do just that. But in terms of what the platform actually allows you to do in sort of easy ways Tableau is just far superior it has a much wider array of different visualizations that are sort of native to the platform itself and then the ability to go ahead and make adjustments or customizations to those native visualizations is just far more streamlined in Tableau it kind of is what it is and you might be thinking can you not make those same visualizations in Power BI Sure, you definitely can. And I have been finding my way working through, you know, the difficulties of actually doing that. But like I said, it is difficult. In terms of Power BI native visualizations, there are very few. You do have the ability to go ahead and download additional visualizations from Power BI. I don't know exactly what they call it, but folks have gone ahead and created additional custom type visualizations you can go ahead and download. And you also have the ability to use R code in Power BI. So you can go ahead and use packages like ggplot to again, create custom visualizations within the platform. Doing any of those things, it's outside of the native realm of Power BI and definitely slows down your tool. They're not optimized to do all of these sort of customizations or workarounds and things like that. So 
So I think on that front, in terms of just being able to create aesthetically pleasing visualizations, Tableau is where it's at. It is, it is just the best platform for those things. That being said, why, why might an organization go ahead and opt for Power BI instead of Tableau? I think one thing that a lot of folks bring to the forefront is the different data source connections. And I don't really think that's a consideration. I think more and more each of these platforms is bringing on more and more connection or API abilities or different connections to different platforms. And I think they're really comparable in that regard. Ultimately, if you have a really specific connection that you're looking to bring in, it might be worth looking through the different connections that are available for either platform. And maybe your company really has you know, a specific thing that they're looking for that might be available in one over the other, but ultimately they both have a plethora of different data connections that you're able to do. And in terms of the most common things that you might be doing, connecting to a specific database that your company uses, connecting to Excel tables or CSVs, text files, like both are pretty good at doing just that. So I don't think that that's something that's going to hold you back. Another thing that both of these platforms will allow you to do are sort of advanced analytic type uh, visualization. So whether that be trends or forecasting or anything like that, simple regressions, both of these platforms have ways to do that. But again, in Power BI, you're going to find yourself having to do a lot of workarounds and sort of hacky type things. Whereas in Tableau, you're really going to have that built in. It actually just has advanced analytics as again, drag and drop type tools that you're able to integrate. So though you're able to do both similar type analysis in both of the platforms, Tableau has really optimized it and made it much more of a streamlined process. In the end of the day, I think that though Tableau is the best tool for the job, why a lot of folks opt for Power BI is it ultimately comes down to price. Especially if you are already a company who is a Microsoft house, Power BI is something that might actually just come with that arsenal of tools or at a really marginal cost. Whereas Tableau is something that is quite a steep cost, a whole other addition you might have to add to your budget. And that's not necessarily something that every company is going to have access to, or maybe doesn't even want to pay the additional cost to do that. I think in terms terms of actually getting into data visualization, like which tool should you learn? I think that the cross between the two is not terribly difficult. There's not a steep learning curve transitioning from Tableau to Power BI or Power BI to Tableau. So if you're a student or just looking to learn visualization and you're wondering which one you should choose, I think you should just choose whichever one is at your disposal. If you're a student, I believe you can get Tableau for a student price or it might even be free if you're taking certain courses with certain institutions. And again, Power BI also has a free version that you're able to play around with online. So whichever one you have easy access to, I would go ahead and learn that. I think whatever skills that you pick up in Power BI, you can easily transfer into Tableau and then vice versa. In my very personal opinion, I really appreciate the fact that I'm going from Tableau to Power BI because I almost know what is possible and I'm able to kind of hack my way through Power BI to make that happen. I think that if I had started in Power BI, I would have felt a lot of limitations and a lot of things wouldn't have been possible to me or I wouldn't have thought that they could be possible as I moved into Tableau. So that's my personal experience on that. You might have a little bit of a different experience transferring between the two. So though I think Power BI is a really great budget option and you're definitely able to create some great tools in terms of dashboarding, you're really able to hack your way through creating customized visualizations. I've seen it done really well. So that's not to say that it's a tool that is, you know, sort of null and void. It definitely has the ability to create really great options for your business or really great analyses for whatever you're working on. But I think in terms of just the most streamlined visualization tool that sort of spits out the best visualizations possible, I think Tableau is still ahead. I do think that because Power BI is sort of within the Microsoft house, it obviously doesn't have that dedication to continue to optimize it. Whereas I feel Tableau, you know, they're only looking at Tableau as a platform and it continues to advance at a speed that I haven't seen happening over on the Power BI end. That's not to say it wouldn't, but as of today, 
I would say that Tableau is definitely the superior visualization tool. Now, a lot of you people who are really hyped about Power BI might be, you know, shaking your head and completely disagreeing with me. I'd love to hear your own experiences on using Tableau over Power BI and which one you prefer in your own professional work. So hopefully we can continue this conversation down in the comments. I'd love to hear your own perspectives and hopefully my sharing of which tool I think is preferential has helped you make your own decisions, whether you are looking to get into the field or bring on one of these tools to your professional capacities. But I'm going to leave it there. I hope you will stick around and consider subscribing to my channel. I hope to create videos on a weekly basis and new videos releasing on every Tuesday at this time. So go ahead and hit the like button as they say, or go ahead and subscribe and I will see you in the next one.